We are at Bangkok Airport and the queue just to check in, it's huge. And this is because it's Friday uh, 19th of July 2024 and there has been an incident, a uh, crowd strike incident that uh, the whole system is down now. So apparently they're gonna try to check us in uh, manually. So which means that they're gonna handwritten a boarding pass, the tag for the luggage, and everything so let's see how many hours i'm gonna have to wait my flight is departing in the next three hours it's been two hours waiting in the queue and uh, the queue has been moving <laughs> that's for certain so i'm afraid that i have to wait for another hour uh, right now they haven't announced any delay or cancellation yet so i have hope <laughs> after three hours of wait we are finally the next person uh to drop a luggage and it is about 10 minutes before this flight departs and uh, i guess they're gonna be delayed but they haven't told us how long yet <laughs> We finally made it uh, just past the immigration and uh, our boarding pass is handwritten. <laughs> That's why it was taking so long to uh, check in each customers, actually because they have to write uh, by hand uh, the entire boarding pass. So I think there will be another hour or so delay. We are gonna find something to eat and Australia here I come <laughs> big tips here for you guys is that uh, make sure that you do your online check-in it uh, can come in handy in the situation like this so I did my online check-in 24 hours uh, before the departure time and the queue for those that have checked in before it's much shorter than those who have not so uh, i waited for two hours in total three hours in total actually to uh, get my boarding pass and then uh, uh, I can see the line of those who have not done the check-in being much longer and now since uh, I have my boarding pass it's been uh, two hours and we are finally boarding. <laughs> Okay, this is a short video just about the incident of today and I will see you later with uh, some travel videos from Australia. Bye-bye.